So let's talk about data transfer costs. So for data transfer, anything that is coming into um, OCI network is going to be free. So data in is free. We call that ingress. Any data that is leaving the OCI network is going to cost us money. We call that uh, egress. And so data transfer within the same availability domain is going to be free. Data transfer between availability domains in the same region is going to be free. Data transfer between regions will uh, result in a charge for data leaving the region. Um, but to really make this clear, I'm going to give you an architectural uh, diagram to, to, to help visualize this. So here is the OCI network. Anything outside of the OCI network will we'll consider the internet. Imagine we have a server running in a data center in a region. And so we have the internet and we want to bring data into that server. So anything uh, uh, that's data in is going to be free. Anything leaving the OCI network, we're going to be charged for. So now imagine we have another region. And in this region, we have an availability domain, a data center. And we have two servers. Maybe they're in different fault domains. Maybe they're different subnets. But the point is they're in the same data center. Any data transfer between them is going to be free. Now imagine we have another data center uh, availability domain in that region, and we want to transfer data between those two. That's going to be free because they're all in the same region. Now imagine, imagine we want to get data from uh, uh, region the CA Toronto uh, one region to the um, AP Toronto one region. So if you send data out, it probably would have to go out to the internet, and and it would and then it would come back in uh, to that other region. And so since it since even though we want to keep it in OCI, the fact that it's another region it has to leave the internet and come back in, it's going to result in a charge. Now, is there some way to bridge uh, data from one region to another? I'm not sure. Uh, there is a service called Service Gateway, but that seems to be for cloud services. But if we could keep it all within OCI, I believe that it would be free. But just remember, if it has to go out to the internet, it's going to cost money. If it stays within OCI, it's going to be free.